Matt epitomizes the great Sate student, right? I, I mean, he just, he's, he came here for a reason. He was a focused man, and he goes, I need this in order to help me build my career. I mean, to me, that's the essence of Sate. You know, Sate did give me a very hands-on approach. Working in the highwood was fantastic. I got to work in the back of the house and work in the kitchen. Uh, and we learned with some really ex excellent chefs and learned how to cook. And uh, my family loves it to this day that I can come home and cook a really fantastic meal as well. The instructors all had great life experience. I still to this day brag about the highwood. Once I graduated from Sate, I had quite a career path. I started as the assistant outlets manager at the Delta Calgary Airport Hotel. From then on, I pursued a position at the Delta Red Deer Hotel and Conference Center as their catering manager. As you're ascending your career, a lot of times what you want to do is go and work in a lot of different areas. One is to see what areas truly interest you, but two, again, every place you go, you're just getting smarter, right, about the entire industry. From then, I became the director of sales at the Calgary Tower. At that time there, I was specifically in charge of corporate sales. So cocktail parties and catering events and uh, special events. Some of the parties and the events that we had on this floor right here at the tower were unbelievable. In the first six months, he basically doubled our corporate business and that's phenomenal. A couple of, couple of years ago, we wanted to do something for the corporate business world in Calgary. And Matt had this fabulous idea of having a James Bond theme up here in the tower. Everything was James Bondish. We had the Casino Royale. We had uh, different little things and everybody was dressed to the nines. The food was spectacular. I was James Bond. Yeah, that was my role for the night. And you know what, if you're playing the event, you get to pick the cool role. That's the way it goes. I said, yeah, you know what, if I'm playing the event, I'm going to be James Bond. <laughs> Right here on the floor, while it's going on, he got five solid leads that turned into events for us. How successful is that? Well, if it's a $20,000 event, that's pretty darn good. When it's a $100,000 event, it brings an awful big smile to the owners of the corporation. Companies recognize that very quickly, right? They, they like people who keep coming up with ideas, who keep coming up with new opportunities. I always call them horses, right? Strong horses you let run. And that, and to me, Matt is like that, right? You let him run because he's gonna add, he, he adds value to an organization. So a great highlight in my career was uh, an opportunity to go help open the Stony Dakota Resort and Casino. Uh, now, the, the crowning achievement in almost any sales manager or any manager's career in the hospitality industry is opening a hotel from scratch. And I was there from the ground up. Guests to the facility will be able to experience more than just a casino facility. There'll be live entertainment, there's going to be fantastic food and beverage. And now I currently hold a position as the Director of Sales of the Service Plus Inns in the Suites Calgary. I can guarantee you right now, Matt knows everything about the hotel that he's selling. Every component of it. Because he'll walk out with full confidence that the team that's sitting in the hotel on the operation side, what he's selling for them, they'll deliver for. One of my favorite positions is I look after a lot of the sports sales. So I sell to a lot of the hockey teams, sporting venues, and we have a lot of the groups that come in here, which is great because our, our chain is very, very involved in the sporting community. My other passion in life is football, and we are a football family. And everybody looks at me and goes, you're not going to the Flames game? I'm like, I'm a football fan. I currently play football for the Calgary Wolfpack senior men's football team as their fullback. And there are too many guys in the league who will disagree with me when I say he's one of the best fullbacks in the league. When the game's on the line, he's the guy who really wants to, to carry the ball and, and help the team in whatever way he can. And any person in any team they've ever played on, you're only as strong as your weakest link. So if the front desk is crashing, if the restaurant is falling apart, you jump in and you help. That's the way it goes because we can only be a successful organization by being a successful team. He's one of those guys who truly understands as a leader that it's not about him, it's about the team, right? And that's what makes him such a great leader because people trust him. You know, it's just that general manager attitude that he has and he will be successful for wherever he ends up. He's gonna do very well in his career. So I think, I think the choice was absolutely fantastic.
Matt, congratulations. Uh, the School of Hospitality and Tourism team is exceptionally proud of you. I can't think of anybody else who is uh, more well-deserved of this uh, prestigious honor.